Welcome back. We appreciate you joining us on this week's special edition of In Focus Kentucky from Churchill Downs. Now, according to Reuters, uh, the most recent Economic Impact Study Commission shows the Kentucky Derby has a $400 million economic impact on the region. Statewide, the equine industry has a $4 billion impact generating over 55,000 jobs. Now, uh, recently we caught up with Kentucky State Representative and Speaker of the House, David Osborne, as he commented on that particular study and shared how he is no stranger to the horse racing industry. Oh, the impact is, is incredible. The, uh, the economic impact of this event alone uh, is, is somewhere approaching a half a billion dollars uh, just for the local community in the region. It's an industry that creates uh, over 60,000 jobs, uh, near, oh, a little over $5 billion in, in total economic output. Uh, so it's a, it's a significant uh, industry year-round and uh, employs, uh, uh, like I said, over, over 60,000 people and got a, a payroll that reaches nearly a billion dollars. Well, I, I do think it is, it is what sets us apart. Uh, it's what sets us apart from uh, and, and it's not just the derby, it's the, the horse industry in general. And, um, you know, I have, uh, I, I've been to Europe and I've seen some, some phenomenal farms and some phenomenal training centers, but, but there's no place where, where you will drive down Versailles Road or uh, Russell Cave Pike or Paris Pike and see farm after farm after farm. And it, it, some estimates uh, indicate that the horse industry saves or conserves about a billion, uh, excuse me, a million acres in Kentucky. Uh, right now, and, and that is that's something that you don't see in other locations, and it really is what makes us different. And we're joined by uh, Darren Rogers, and Darren, appreciate your time having us here at Churchill Downs. Oh, it's always great talking Derby and Churchill. And one of those uh, big talkers is obviously the uh, revenue side of the business, where it obviously generates hundreds of millions of dollars each year at the track, but also throughout the region. Uh, talk about the economic impact and what uh, this facility, but also just horse racing in general, has done for this in, for this area. Yeah, the em economic impact uh, of the Kentucky Derby, uh, you know, it was a couple hundred million dollars. Um, back in 2001 and I think uh, how much the Kentucky Derby has grown not just nationally but internationally right. within those last 18 years it's absolutely tremendous uh, uh, I love seeing the restaurants fall uh, the hotel rooms fall uh, the entire uh, community benefits from it and think about Thunder over Louisville I mean that you know that grows every year the different events the festivals putting on uh, it, it really is a couple of weeks where Louisville, Kentucky is the center of the world, especially on the first Saturday in May. And we take great pride in that. I know the community takes great pride in that. And it's a tremendous economic driver. And obviously rain or shine, uh, it does not stop people from coming out and being a part of the experience. Here. No, absolutely not. No, rain or shine, we're, 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 we're focused. Well, Darren, we again, uh, we appreciate your time uh, updating us on all things Churchill Downs and getting our viewers uh, ready and excited for uh, uh, the big weekend coming up. Thank you so much for the time and the visit, and uh, good luck on Derby Day. Absolutely. Appreciate it. And we want to thank you for joining us today on our special edition of In Focus Kentucky from Churchill Downs. And uh, be sure to stay with us here on Spectrum News 1 all week long as our news team will be bringing you coverage from all the festivities leading up to the Kentucky Oaks and Derby later this week. Until next time, though, have a great week.